Honourable Senators, family, friends of our retiring colleague, we gather today to celebrate Canada's first Mi'kmaq Senator, the honourable, formidable and highly lovable Dan Christmas. Recently, while discussing Senator Christmas with Al Fleming, the word, gra the word gravitas came to my mind. Gravitas was one of the ancient Roman virtues that denotes seriousness, dignity and importance and connotes restraint and moral rigour. It conveys a sense of responsibility and commitment to the task and in ancient Rome was appreciated as an ideal characteristic in leaders. Colleague Senator Dan Christmas, the intelligent, humble, kind and highly effective leader from Member 2 in Unamagi embodies gravitas and inspires each one of us to be better people and to undertake our responsibilities as he does with wisdom and care. In his 2017 Father Greg McLeod lecture, Dan said, I quote, perhaps the greatest thing I've learned is that to be an effective parliamentarian means having to speak truth to power, not bellowing from a high horse or prescribing from a position of power and entitlement, but by working diligently to provoke meaningful and pragmatic dialogue, not necessarily to dictate a litany of complaints about what's wrong, but rather working with others to determine options for the right way forward. Colleague Senator Dan Christmas came to us having had a successful career as a change maker and he heightened that trajectory here in Canada's upper chamber contributing to positive change through his roles as chair of the Senate Standing Committee on Indigenous Peoples, ushering into law Bill C-15, the foundational UNDRIP Act, his effective sponsorship of Bill C-68, Modernizing the Fisheries Act, his important work on the Mi'kmaq Moderate Livelihood Fishery, and many, many other contributions. For us, Senator Christmas has been a guide, a hand extended, helping to point us in the right direction. In June 2021, remarking on the tragic discovery of the 215 unmarked graves in Kamloops, Dan said, Today, Canada is a nation awash in a tidal wave of tears, and we must let them flow. Our people, my people, and yes, your people, are steeped in grief and sorrow. We mourn our lost babies, our lost culture, our lost freedoms, the disassociation from our lands and traditions, and the way we must endlessly struggle to convince Canada to understand, to appreciate, and to embrace who we are and what we continue to aspire. Senator Dan Christmas, you are in Mi'kmaq, Gemi Delmut Niganis, a highly respected leader. My friend Dan, your legacy is vast. I, we all thank you. I'm honored to know you and I wish you and your beautiful family every happiness. Walal and Dan. Thank mm -hmm. you.